and I'll be able to use the bathroom. Since they came in my tent while I was gone and stole my bags. Stole one shoe. Now, I'm not going to bother with that. Because I still have some food and water. But if they do that this time, it's going to be hell to tell the captain. And I done told them that. Now, you know they stole most of my property on the 8th when I was released. If you're going to do a site release, why would you take my property and when I go pick it up, it's gone. Food and water. And I had very few dollars, but that's the point. They don't want me to be able to survive out like this, out here. I'm not going to let anybody do that to me. And, uh... One of the viewers made a comment the other day when I put a video up about arguing with them, officers, saying you have to be calm. You have to, I have tried all kind of compromises. I have bowed down. I can bend, but I'll never let them break me. I can bend, but I won't break. So if you don't stand for something, you'll fall for anything. Sometimes you got to take a stand. You just cannot let people walk all over you. Jesus didn't even do that. Jesus didn't do that. There's a story of Jesus going to the temple in the city during the feast, the Passover, I think it was. And he went into the temple, and uh, they were in there selling uh, poultry, uh, not sacrifices, but the doves and the lambs and the sheep, they were bought to. I'll finish the story in a minute. 